Staying on the topic of abortion, President Biden, seven states, I'll let you do that, uh, this is the same topic, seven states have no legal restrictions on how far into a pregnancy a woman can obtain an abortion. Do you support any legal limits on how late a woman should be able to terminate a pregnancy? I supported Roe v. Wade, which had three trimesters. The first time is between the woman and the doctor. Second time is between the doctor and an extreme situation. The third time is between the doctor, I mean, be between the, the woman and the state. The idea that the politicians, the, the, that the founders wanted the politicians to be the ones making decisions about women's health is ridiculous. That's the last, no politician should be making that decision. A doctor should be making those decisions. That's how it should be run. That's what you're gonna do. And if I'm elected, I'm gonna restore Roe v. Wade. So that means he can take the life of the baby in the ninth month and even after birth, because some states, Democrat run, take it after birth. Again, the governor, former governor of Virginia, put the baby down, then we decide what to do with it. So he's, in, he's willing to, as we say, rip the baby out of the womb in the ninth month and kill the baby. Nobody wants that to happen, Democrat or Republican. Nobody wants it to happen. You're lying. That is simply not true that Roe v. Wade does not provide for that. That's not the circumstance. Only if a woman's life is in danger, she's gonna die. That's the only circumstance in which that can happen. But we are not for late-term abortion, period. Period, period. Under Roe v. Wade, you have late-term abortion. You can do whatever you want, depending on the state. You can do whatever you want. We don't think that's a good thing. We think it's a radical thing. We think the Democrats are the radicals, not the Republicans. For 51 years, that was the law. 51 years, Constance Scholarship said it was the right way to go. 51 years, and it was taken away because this guy puts very conservative members on the Supreme Court. He takes credit for taking it away. What's he going to do? What's he going to do, in fact, if the, if the MAGA Republicans, he gets elected, and the MAGA Republicans control the Congress, and they pass a universal ban on abortion, period, across the board, at six weeks or seven or eight or ten weeks, something very, very conservative. Is he going to sign that bill? I'll veto it. He'll sign it. Thank you. Let's turn now to the issue of immigration.